Hey guys, for today's video, I have the new lip mask from Milk Makeup. This is the Melatonin Overnight Lip Mask, and I'm going to compare it to everyone's staple, the Laneige Lip Sleeping Mask. So the Milk one is 29 Canadian or 22 US dollars. You get eight grams or 0.28 ounces, which is more money and less product than the Laneige. The Laneige is 26 Canadian or 20 US dollars, and you get 20 grams, 0.28 seven ounces. The Milk Makeup one though is cruelty free. I know a lot of people love the Laneige one, but they don't want to repurchase it or buy it for the first time to try it because it's not cruelty free. The packaging for the Milk one is cute. I like the purple shade. Um, it does not come with an applicator. If I don't use an applicator anyways, but this one doesn't come with one. The Laneige one comes with a little stick applicator so you don't have to get your hands in there. The Milk one just has the one scent or flavor. Um, it smells like lavender, it's quite soothing. It goes on clear. Um, the lavender scent is not too overpowering. I find I can smell it just in the tub, like when I put my nose up to it, I can smell it. While I'm wearing it though, I don't really notice the scent at all. I'm currently on Sephora Canada, I can see five different options for the Laneige. They have the original, which is berry scented. They have vanilla, they have apple lime. They have grapefruit, which is the one that I have. It's my favorite one. And they also have sweet candy. So neither brands have like an unscented version. Um, I know a lot of people can be irritated by scents, especially having them that close to your nose. It's like right there. The milk one, I will say, I don't notice the lavender while it's actually on, but I've never been one to be irritated by scents and that kind of thing. I'm always skeptical with trying a new lip mask just because the Laneige one is so good. Um, I've tried the Bite one, it's okay, it's not great. Um, I tried the Tatcha one recently, I don't like that one. Um, I tried one from Tarte, I don't like that one. I have yet to find one that's anywhere near as good as the Laneige one, until now. Yeah, the Milk one is really good. The consistency of the Milk Mask is more sticky and kind of more stiff than the Laneige. The Laneige is really creamy and fluid formula. The Milk one, it's not sticky while it's on your lips. It kind of like melts in, so it is comfortable to wear. It's not like this gross layer. They're both a thick lip mask, so you're gonna feel either one, but they're both equally comfortable as far as a lip mask goes. Both of them, you can feel it sinking in and working and repairing your lips. After just one night of the Milk one, my lips felt so good in the morning. They felt repaired, they felt hydrated, they felt like I would never need to put lip balm on again. They just were so, it worked surprisingly well with short-term and long-term hydration. Like my lips felt so good after just one night and with other lip masks besides Laneige, like that is just not the case. So now I have two lip masks that I love. So the Milk one is a really good cruelty-free option. It's a cruelty-free option that is as good as the Laneige. It works just as well. I can't even say that one is better than the other because they're both just, really good. <laughs> so the two main kind of deciding factors, if you're thinking like which one is better, I mean, the milk one is more expensive and you get less product. So if money's your main thing, go with the Laneige, but the milk one is cruelty free. So if that's important to you, definitely go with the milk one. You will not be disappointed. It works really well. I know that's a struggle for a lot of people to try and find a cruelty free version of the Laneige lip mask. And I can confidently say that the milk mask, this one is it. The other ones that I've tried, Bite, not good. It's okay, but it's not It's not as good as the Laneige. Tatcha, no, don't even try it. I waste of money. Anyways, that's all I have for today's video. Thanks so much for watching and I'll see you later. Bye.